According to reports, Major League Baseball is leaning toward implementing a pitch clock into games starting with the 2018. The idea behind this is that the game of baseball has become too slow and perhaps too antiquated for a new generation of fans. It seems ludicrous to many of us who love the game so much but speeding up the game in has been a mantra of Commissioner Rod Manfred since he took over MLB's highest office. In short order, baseball officials believed that by cutting down time between innings as well as every pitch thrown to every batter, 10 minutes could be shaved off a regular game. A good explanation of what exactly could happen next can be found by clicking here. Last baseball games averaged 308 so, in theory, yes, these changes could move games below 3 hours. But at what cost? It seems that it could set the stage for frustration from players and managers, perhaps even adding time to the game when they don't believe the clock was started at the correct time. There is a reason why Major League players rejected this idea, and it's very likely that players will remember they voted it down and show their displeasure for the forced changes when the begins. Baseball has already joined its brethren in football and basketball with instant replays. While ensuring that the right call is made, this has also added time to the game as well. When this idea was implemented, it was about improving the game. I agree that it has and I am certainly willing to wait a few extra seconds or even minutes to make sure the right call was made when a runner slides into home plate on a bang-bang call that could eventually determine the game's outcome. Look, I understand it can be frustrating when a pitcher keeps throwing to first base, hoping to throw off the timing of Charlie Blackman so he can't steal a base. But, to me, that is also part of the game that we all grew up watching. How many times did I see the pitcher throw to first when Ricky Henderson of Vince Coleman was occupying that bag? Baseball fans, me included, may get temporarily annoyed with something during the game, but it doesn't keep them, us from coming back to the park or watching the next night's game on television. We love the sport that much. Picture this, Wade Davis has two strikes on Bryce Harper with two outs in the ninth and the Rockies are clinging to a 4-3 lead. Nationals have a runner on second and Harper can tie the game or give Washington the advantage with one swing. Do we really need a clock bearing down on Davis or any other pitcher during this situation? Don't we want the pitcher throwing his best pitch to get the batter out, not just hurrying through the signs so he can beat the clock? If 10 minutes is really enough for Major League Baseball to think it's going to bring back fans to the game, maybe we've lost a little piece of our national pastime already. I understand the draw to try to reach a population that is addicted to its phone and a sense of instant gratification, but it doesn't seem to stop people from spending 2 hours and 35 minutes watching the latest installment of Star Wars or 2 hours and 27 minutes watching, Captain America, Civil War, sure, the action is more immersive with a movie, but if you're drawn to just action, baseball probably isn't your game anyway. There's a strategy with baseball and it has a movement and pace of its own. It's a movement and rhythm that my grandpas first introduced me to long ago and one that I was glad to introduce my daughter to, just like countless dads have done with their children through the years. If a pitch clock is to be, it is to be. I doubt Mr. Manfred is looking for my opinion anyway. However, I do worry about the game of baseball trying to be rushed too much. We come together at Coors Field to watch Nolan Arenado do amazing things, socialize and enjoy those sunsets that can't be matched at any other park. I don't mind being there an extra 10 minutes because that's time that I spend watching the game that I love with my friends and family. Those are moments to me that don't need to be rushed. Rather, they need to be savoured and enjoyed to their rest.